Hello everyone. In the previous tutorial, I have shown you a simple use of if else. Now in this one, we will see uh, how to use if else if we want to check multiple condition like uh, how we are going to um, form a proper structure for if else ladder. So let's say uh, here uh, I am having three vector B. And in, in this vector, I am having Ramesh, Dinesh, and one more U, Ram, Rahim. So what I want to do is that I want to check Mac exist in which of these vector. So in first uh, condition I am checking if Mac exist in first vector. If this is not the case I need to check whether this exists in B or if that is also not the case then I will go for D. So here what we need to do is after this else we need to write if and here we need to write the same condition with different vector. So we are going to write Mac in B. If uh, this is the case, we will say name in found in B. And in the first case, we will <coughs> we will write name is found in A. And if this is also not the case, then we will go for else if Mac in B. So if this is true, then we will write name is found in D. And at last, else, we simply will write print name is not found. So let's see the execution of this script. So it's saying name is found in A. Now let's try to change it. Let's make it Dinesh. And here also we need to go for Dinesh, Dinesh, and run. So it's now found in B. So in this manner you can uh, use your if else ladder, which we, if you remember, if you are a C programmer or C++ programmer, we used to write if else ladder. So in R also we can do the same. So this is the way to write multiple ifs together. Thank you very much for watching.